Hi, welcome back to the channel. Um, I'm Gwen, just by myself. Um, <laughs> You're not by yourself. Yes, I am. It's a PSA. Public service announcement. Um, yeah, we're preparing for uh, the hurricane. Um, Tropical storm Ian. Yeah, but they're pretty pretty sure that it's gonna um, turn into a a hurricane and we are kind of in the vicinity and we are under a state of emergency in preparation so um we kind of this is today saturday this is actually the day of our pin sale but we kind of found out yesterday we we're kind of clueless and i'm usually up to date on that kind of stuff but um found out yesterday about the hurricane and we me and Lauren were out. We quick went to BJ's. Everybody was buying water. We got water. Um, and did we get it? We didn't get anything else, did we? Juice. Juice, yeah. But we had to get Richie from school, so we couldn't hang we out. We were going to go back in, but then we said we might go there Monday. Monday. But I'm just worried now that everything is going to be um, sold out because we've heard. So, so pictures. There might be limits. And so we were able to get some water. I think we're okay. I mean, it might not hurt to pick up a couple more, but um, <laughs> but before this all started, I had started to get our because you know we should have had a kit even last year. But I got a um, a radio. I think it's, it's a is it a crank? It's a crank and and solar power. Solar power here, and they do have a crank that you can pop that out. And crank the battery charge in case at night and it does have a it is a radio and a flashlight so i had purchased all this stuff on amazon thankfully starting like two weeks ago last week so they all came so we have some lanterns do you want to demonstrate the lanterns go with me? cool and i did read the reviews on them so it's a round box batteries go in the back but you got the, the light there and you can use the handle so you can hold it like this as a flashlight. Then you can, it has two pieces on the back, both hooked the other way. So it all depend on if you need this to hang from something, you can uh, hook it on to something. And even if you kind of hook it on and put it on the line, you can then do it like that and that way it won't no blow over or fall out or anything. And then there's magnets. And then there's magnets on the side that uh, on the back that you can stick so it will, you know, hold it like that or whatever way or even like that if there's you metal above you. Huh? You put it up too high. Put it, you know, you can hang it whichever way. And then you can also open it up. You might want to cover your eyes because then you know, once you pull it apart, it's a lantern. That's pretty bright. That's what I bought it for, the lantern. I didn't know it was all the other stuff. But, um, so I got that. I bought this. He's charging this now. I bought this it's a battery operated. It's rechargeable battery operated fan. Fan. And then at Target, or Target, I went to Walmart. I just got back from Walmart and they had this. The lady was ringing up. She's like, it's 16.77. And she's like, giving me this funny look. And she goes, that can't be right. And I was like, yeah, yeah, it is. But, um, and then thinking it was too expensive for that. I hope I could stand that up and it's not just a clip. But everything was picked through. So, and I had ordered this first aid. No, I didn't order this. This is from Walmart. I actually um, picked this up earlier this week. So, thankfully I did because I probably didn't even have any of them left. So... What we've got, what I just went to the store to get. Now we do have paper plates and probably enough paper cups, but I figured we won't be washing dishes and stuff. It's best just to pick up extra cups. Um, this was the only thing they had left. And I know it's cheapy and even though it was $15, actually 16 probably. Um, so they're probably gonna break. But I didn't want to take the chance. I we like Costco's, and that's what we always used to use back in Delaware for parties and stuff. When we would host Christmas Eve, we would always buy Costco Kirkland brand 
and we really liked it. It was sturdy, but um, we're not, I don't want to take the chance to wait to go there and they don't have it. And I don't know, we never looked at BJ's. So I just figured, get some snacks. We can always need chips and I can actually make dinner. I can do my taco salad with that. And I bought some tarps because I went down the camping aisle and just to see what they had. All their flashlights were completely sold out. But I saw these and they weren't that bad of a price. So I figured just in case the window goes out or something. So, and then I got rice because I figured you know, we can boil water. Over. He likes fiber. Why not do some Because I was reading up in like their checklist and what they say to get. They say like rice products and pasta pot products because you can cook them. You know, boil the water over the, over a grill and you can make chicken fried rice. Um, <laughs> do it that way. I wish we did have a gas grill though, because it's just to make it a little more convenient. And um, Apple Jacks now granted no milk, even though they did say to get powder milk, but I did not see any. I did get a can of evaporated milk because I had a big stack of them. Get, um, my almond milk. Well, they uh, the, uh, the little area that I saw. The, there wasn't anything now. Um, so yeah, I got Apple Jacks because we, I mean, we used to always just grab a handful of Apple Jacks and eat them anyway. Um, we had gotten this at BJ's. Well, I, we really liked it. Hopefully it's the same. It's just something. And I did get styrofoam bowls because I hadn't originally thought about that, but then I was like, yeah, we won't need those. I just got gallon freezer bags because we needed them. And then, um, obviously they say to get canned goods. Well, I before I get to them. I did get and granola bars, so I just was not much to choose from. So I know we like the peanut ones. Never had these before, but like I said, not much to choose from. So we got what we got. And we do like Slim Jim, so I picked up two of those. Um, Pop-Tarts were picked over, so I got brown sugar and chocolate big thing and then i had read that these were something that you should get um the powdered things to add to water just to give your water you know different flavor so i got iced tea with lemon and this is sugar free so this will, oh, they were all sugar free crap i didn't realize that iced tea with lemon and raspberry and lemonade i got that for those guys thinking that wasn't sugar free but it is maybe they won't tell I won't tell them but no they are iced tea with peach no i got that this one isn't it's mango punch um and then i just got some fruit cocktail i guess nobody likes minestrone thankfully i love minestrone soup so <laughs> they had Quite a few I could have probably bought way more, but and then they, I grabbed a vegetable. I only had one can of that minestrone, and then minestrone. Thought there was another can. Still have some in here too. Hmm. I thought I had another vegetable. That's not a problem. So yeah, and then Campbell's. I got beef with vegetable and barley. That's for me. And then um. I got Moana because she was all by her little self. <laughs> and I got some baked beans. They didn't have Lauren's kind, so she's going to have to eat the country style. And I got chili. They say to get chili, and she doesn't like beans, so thankfully they had the no beans. And then I got pineapple chunks because we all like pineapple and slices. And this was the evaporated milk I got, which I don't know what we'll do with that. We just needed spicy brown mustard. You're not. Hold that. And um, they always said to have trash bags. Um, they actually said to make sure you had, they had a big five gallon bucket. And I should have picked that up. They said they buy dried fruit, which that was picked over. They had, Pineapple, pineapple chunks. They had coconut chunks, which is what I like. And I like banana chips, so they had those. Um, I did just buy these as something different, but it is no sugar added. But 
I don't just maybe taste like regular pears. I don't know. I'm not. Oh, sorry. I'm not able. Um, but again, this stuff I am going to actually put in here like we're supposed to. Uh, thing I want. I really want a different one, but this is what our some of our Halloween decorations were. So it's empty right now. So I'm just going to use that. And I'm just going to put this stuff in there, and it's going to be our hurricane kit. So even if it's not a waste because we have to keep it. And then obviously stuffed up on bread because bread's kind of going out. And I did get, I needed bleach because we don't have any bleach. And they say something about putting a drop of bleach in your water that you're supposed to fill up your bathtub with. And it can't be one that has like a different kind of bleach. Like a Clorox still, yeah, just and they didn't have it, but I like this scent, and I hadn't seen it since COVID, so I have got them. Um, and Richie likes bagels, something different. We got hot dog buns because we have hot dogs on the grill, and obviously, we have other you know canned goods. And, and then I did buy uh, uh, an extra bag of charcoal because I have a charcoal grill and lighter fluid, lighter fluid. And no, I got them yesterday and the shelves were full when I saw them. So, um, we have peanut butter, we have extra jelly, but then the jelly needs to be refrigerated. Well, Rich made a point about fluff, but I don't know if it's still the... That's not that old, I don't think. But you know, like... It's I don't know, it gets weird. funny here. You never got funny back in Delaware, but... Unless you had it for years and years and years. But... Yeah, so I think, I don't know, I'll have to check my list, but I mean, I know we still need a couple action all our things, but well, I think we're, we're good. Yeah, I mean, like, like I, when I went down the rice aisle, there was like nothing left, like to even just look at like different rice dishes, but I knew we had some stuff, so. But yeah, so we'll keep you up to date. We don't know what to do about windows, sliding glass doors. Are we to we pour? Are removing all of our patio. Yeah, we got to remove all our patio and plants that aren't that are in pots. And I guess bring it all in. Well, like we do have some cushions that? right there. I'm um, put a lot of stuff in the garage. I'm not going to be able to get much more in there. So uh, we'll keep you updated. And I just want to get in the pool before it's like, and then I think, I don't know if we have to drain the pool a little bit, but we'll probably lose some screens. And we actually just found like a couple replaced. So that's going to be, hopefully we'll cross our fingers that one. It turns out to be nothing, but I don't think that's, quite gonna happen but hopefully it'll just be rain and that's it all right well that's all i have so like i said don't want my hair even though lauren said your hair looks better like that than it does on a normal day I I go, thanks like, like i looked horrible not like when we not in the morning but like after a perfect like you just when went, i'm all sweaty and nasty yeah you just went out like running around and doing stuff yeah. all right so Thanks for watching and we'll probably, I don't know if we'll end this here or if we'll add or start another vlog with us getting prepared and then obviously on the day that it arrives, well, I'm sure we'll turn the camera on at some point as long as we're all not freaking out. But all right, well, please like, comment and subscribe and let us know if you've ever had to, uh, do this for hurricane now granted we did have hurricanes in delaware and actually the last 10 years or so they had been more frequent and i mean we got hit pretty hard with sandy we had a tornado that came off of the hurricane but we were still far enough away from the coast that it wasn't like that huge of an impact um but here you know florida being a peninsula and I mean, kind of some of the models look like Tampa and we're not that really that far from Tampa. So that's what I'm a little concerned about, but all right. So that's it. So let us know if you've ever had to do this and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.